Fuck with the act heavy. Shout out DB4TV, you already know the fuck we rockin'. Yeah, shout out DB4TV, you already know the fuck we rockin'. Yeah, shout out DB4TV, you already know the fuck we rockin'. Yeah, shout out DB4TV, you already know the fuck we rockin'. Yeah, shout out DB4TV, you already know the fuck we rockin'. Right now, I wanna give a big shout out to my brother, DB. TV. Yeah. Fuckin' with me. Understand what I'm saying? Understand what I'm saying? Understand what I'm saying? And dear God, I know you want more for my life But listen God, I'm just trying to make all my wrongs right And it won't happen overnight, I just hope it do And all the wishes I've been wishing, hope they come true I got a lot of direction for how I wanted to do this video From Liz Letter to Bino You know, it ain't every day a person with uh, Great influence got their time cut short. A person that was trying to make the best of that situation while putting on for their family at the same time. And I feel like D B and Don Bino shared those same traits. They both had that put on for your city type vibe. And I'm just speaking on these things based on how they represented their talents and how they touched me, whether it was through a song or through a YouTube video. DB was shining a bright eyes light on the city. Just him being as active as he was, making music videos, showing up to events, and always showcasing people in the best way he possibly could. And that easily separated him from the competition and he stood out as a YouTuber and as a person, honestly. And, uh, he created his own lane. But see, when I got that call about what had happened, it kind of affected me similar to the same way when I heard about Don Bino. At first, at first it deflated me. At first it had me, it had me like, you know, I was losing hope. I was, you know, it was, it was a big hit, but, um, I came to this conclusion, I said, I can't control that God felt it was his time. I can't control that. God felt he had fulfilled his purpose. I can't control that God called him home for a higher purpose. I can't control that. But what I can control is how I let it affect me and how I represent him from this day forward. I can choose whether or not I shine him in the brightest light possible how he did for countless people in this city. And I feel like he deserved that from everybody in this city. I personally feel like he was going to the top. He has something that a lot of people don't got nowadays, and that's vision. He thought about the bigger picture. He believed he can make a change single-handedly, and he did just that. DB, the air, because. I want to take the time out to tell you some things I never got to tell you. I want to tell you that you was an inspiration to this city. More importantly, you was an inspiration on my life. And after school, I always remember scrolling through DB's channel, trying to get hip to the latest, you know, music video, whether it had been Jig or, or Yola or Squad Rupal or or Duffel Bag or Lil Mont, and them names is just the tip of the iceberg for countless artists, you know, coming about the city. And uh, shout out to all y'all, but uh, back then I didn't see the bigger picture of, of, of what he really was doing. He really was, he really was putting us out there as a city. He really was, he really was, you know, he really was putting that African culture out there for everybody to see front and center, you know? And um, from here, you know you know how overlooked we is as a city. We we overlook ourselves sometimes, and uh, that's not good, but DB, DB was different. DB really put really put that acting life out there for everybody to see, and um, I just feel like his name should never die for that, ever. And if that means me taking it into my own hands to make sure it don't happen, then that's what I'm gonna do. Every chance I get, I'm gonna incorporate your name into my ideas and into my videos and 
I feel like I shouldn't be the only person to do that. I feel like it's other people that was touched by that grind. Why not show somebody some appreciation? Why hide your feelings if somebody affected your life, you know, in a positive way? I hate that I didn't get to let him notice why he was here, but I know he's still living through all of us. But I want to use this as a lesson to appreciate somebody's greatness while they're here and to let them know how much they impacted you, no matter who it is. With that being said, I'm about to roll this clip for y'all real quick. Watch it. DB is way more than rap. DB, here, because I want to take the time out to tell you some things I never got to tell you. I want to tell you that you was an inspiration to this city. More importantly, you was an inspiration in my life. Big shout out to K Man for doing this tattoo for me. I really appreciate you, bro. If you in Akron and you ever need a tattoo, hit up the Lions Den. Uh, Mike Reed on Facebook. Don't be hitting him up if you ain't really trying to get no tat. That's you feel me. Don't don't be on that. You dig what I'm saying? But uh, great people over there. You know nothing but love. But uh, you ain't gotta click on my channel. You ain't gotta check my channel out today. Today not about me. Today about DB. Um, if you watching this, please go check out DB's channel. He got a lot of music videos he did for people. He got a lot of concerts he uh he recorded for big artists. So maybe might, might be your favorite artist. You never know. You feel me? But uh, if you get a chance. Make sure you go check out DB's channel if you can. Hit that subscribe button. What I want to do is I want to get his channel to a hundred thousand subscribers. Um, it can be me or him first. It don't really matter who get it first. But my thing is, me and him both is going to achieve this goal at, at some point in time, you feel me? I just feel like he deserves 100,000 subscribers. His family, his mom, his dad, his kids, they deserve to, you know, have that plaque hanging up on the wall. If you're watching this, please hit that subscribe button for DB. I know it don't seem like much, but one by one, it's going to add up, and eventually, we're going to reach this goal for him. So, if you want to be a part of the movement, make sure you subscribe to DB's channel. That's all you got to do. But if you want to really contribute to his legacy, what I'm going to be doing is I want to start up, uh, I don't want to say a challenge, but like just a social media thing. You could post anything, DB for TV. It could be a picture of him. It could be... A screenshot of this video a screenshot of a music video he did for you anything it can be anything db for tv post it with the hashtag db for tv ltm and the ltm stands for live through me so if you really want to contribute to that legacy if you really want to you know what i'm saying if you really feel like he was a a great person a great you know a great influencer uh any of those things make sure you do that post it on anything you feel me just use the hashtag db for tv ltm so all you gotta do it ain't that hard you feel me it's free you feel me you don't gotta pay to post you feel me you don't gotta pay to use the hashtag just do it you know what i'm saying contribute to his legacy uh you know what i'm saying it's all for db this for it's for the family you feel what i'm saying so it ain't like it's just a random thing like it's for a good cause so you watching this, you feel me? You want to help, not even help. You just want to, you want to be a part of something.
can go ahead and do that. But if you watching this, just please make sure you hit that subscribe button. Um, if you want to go that extra mile, please share the video, share his channel. I mean, we trying to get his channel to 100,000 subscribers. So he can get that play button. You know what I'm saying? Um, the numbers is going to add up one by one. So even if you think you're not doing much just by hitting subscribe, it's going to add up. And one turn into two, two turn into four, four turn into eight. You see me on and on. So um, don't feel like um, it's not gonna you 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 hitting subscribe is not gonna change anything. It's gonna change. Obviously, it's gonna change the number. Even if it's just by one, that one is gonna add up. So uh, please, for I'm trying to get this done. I'm I'm trying to do this for DB. You know what I'm saying. I want this to be a lesson to appreciate somebody while they're here, not when they're gone, you know what I'm saying? I, I feel like DB should have got way more appreciation from the city than he did from me. I, I take the blame on this one. He should have got more appreciation from me. Um, just from the fact that, you know what I'm saying, he kind of changed my life just because he was doing YouTube when nobody around. I don't think. I don't think. Like not from my memory, nobody around here was doing YouTube. You know what I'm saying? So he kind of instilled it in me that you know it's possible. You know that a person from Akron, Ohio, could get paid from a big corporation like YouTube just to make videos. You know what I'm saying? So I love you, DB, and you will forever live. Saying live for today, cause you gotta die one day. Heart full of pain, say you gon' cry one day. But what you afraid of, you gotta try one day. So show what you made of, you gotta shine one day. I gotta make it some way, I'ma make it one day. I'm just tryna touch cake, punk or resort to gunplay. But watch out for the tattletales. And it's snakes without a rattletail. Niggas hoping that I fail. But all I need is my phone and it's fucking scary.